Okay. Ready? Take it away. What did you go as last night? What did I go? Yeah. That's... What were you? What were you dressed oh, as? Yeah. <laughs> Stash. <recognized>. Oh, <laughs> yes. It was the dancing machine. Yes. <laughs> and you gave us a bit of a sing song as well, didn't you? I did. I did a little singing. I had a little. Uh... <laughs> Caitlin just goes. Yeah, you sang last night. Didn't like it. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Go. Cool. Keeping the truth. <laughs> All right. We are back between two Yetis with Derek from Denison. How are you, buddy? Great, how are you, sir? Good, you helped us out a lot yesterday getting our Yetis off the boat. Yes, sir, I do all the uh, event production and uh, boat shows with Bob Denison and uh, making, it, making it all come to life. Very cool. How is the event going for you? It's going great. I mean, it's, a, it's, a, it's hot, but it, we're in the islands. It's a beautiful place. It's a, an amazing experience. I mean, everybody's having a good time. The drinks are flowing. The food is amazing. The, the people, the vibes. It's awesome. You're very energetic today, aren't you? Always. After, after last night's uh, festivities, <laughs> I'm quite impressed. I mean, we were dancing a little bit. We had a little you know, shimmy shaking going on. It was and I think we got that on video, didn't we? Oh, no. What, the um, <laughs> dancing? Yeah. Some of it. We'll have to search through the archive. We'll, we'll, we'll chop that bit in. All right, so what happened was, let me just say, <laughs> <laughs> the drinks were flowing, the food was good, the vibes were high, so it was, it was a good time. Very, very cool. But yeah, overall, the event's been quite a good success for you. It's been great, it's been great. The weather's held up. I mean, we've had some amazing people. Mm -hmm. you know, it's all about the people and the experience, the, the kids, the, the energy, everything's, everything's just going in place. So. I've noticed this is a very family-orientated event. Yes, it is, and that's, that's what we're here for. It's a rendezvous, you know? Because I've been on some, not other rendezvous as such, but like some poker runs I've been on and stuff. That's very adult and geared. Yeah, I mean, we're, we're all family. It's one big family, so not just the kids. It's, it's, you know, we're all here together and we're all in this as a family, so, you know. How long have you been working with Denison for? Um, I've been producing boat shows in general um, for about the past seven years. So, right. Um, I just joined Denison's team and I uh, produced the Palm Beach boat show. Very cool. The whole display. Um, I have a couple different clients at the boat show, so. Very cool. It's, it, it's, he's one of my favorites. He's definitely, you know. He's definitely a cool guy. He brings the energy too, so I mean, I feed off his energy and mm -hmm. we make stuff happen. So today is the last day of the event. Yes, sir. But you're looking forward to going home? Oh, you have no idea. I'm actually <laughs> flying out to New Jersey to do the Mid-Atlantic Fishing Tournament up in... Uh, oh, the Mid-Atlantic 500? Cape May and um, yeah, it used to be the 500. It's now just the Mid Atlantic. Um, but Cape May. They the price up. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, the price went up. I believe it's like three thousand dollars a leg, but. It's, wow. it's fun. And didn't someone get banned from that tournament last year or lose the prize money uh, or that something? That was actually the White Marlin Open, but yeah, it was like a $2 million prize went. Um, and that's because he didn't have a fishing permit, right? Or fishing license? Actually, they, once you touch the rod, that person's supposed to reel it in. Yeah. And that, it was a, a female that, that just touched the rod and then handed it off and it, they lost $2 million in prize money. Wow. And it got... It got spread out amongst the, the, you know, the second, third place, and a couple wow. other people. So Ooh. it's a shame, but you know, you got to play by the rules. And my God, I bet she's not well liked. <laughs> now, is she? Holy hell! I mean, it's it's a team effort on that. So yeah. it really, really is. So you've been in this for seven years. Yes, sir. Uh, but you, you don't work directly for Denison, or are you I own my own company. I own four okay. events. So very cool. Yeah, I used to work for the Miami Dolphins and the Miami Heat. Uh, I used to work for the CEO of the Dolphins. Yeah, and courtside for the Miami Heat, and then. Got recruited by the magazine, uh, uh, Active Interest Media. Okay. It's international, passion yeah, yeah. makers, soundings, trade only. Um, started producing all their events, became the marketing events manager for that company. Right. And then finally branched off to my own, and I have a bunch of teammates that go out and help me produce these events. And Very cool. Congratulations. How long ago was that? Uh, actually, this year is my first year of my own company. Congratulations. So thank you. It's a big step. Hopefully it really in the right is. Direction, you know? Yeah, no, I, I started my company three years ago, and it's a, it's a hell of a step to go from the corporate world to working out your bedroom, that's uh, right. Because Jerry's no days off, no days off, and you know, Jerry Springer's on at 10, and <laughs> my god, every day, you got some competition there. Huh? <laughs> I know Maury's on at four, so <laughs> dear oh dear, a sneaky in between there. Yeah. So, what's next for Denison? What's the next event? Um, we're actually already planning our, our April rendezvous, so we'll be we'll be doing all the marketing uh, come January, so we'll okay. be making all the announcements and whatnot. Um, Where we, are you thinking of going? Uh, we're doing a Keys, we're doing Florida Keys, so very cool. It's our hometown, I'm born and raised in Fort Lauderdale. Keys, yep. Keys is our back door, so yeah. Backyard, so. absolutely. I mean, it pretty much has everything that this place has, but this is kind of this is more fun. This is more exotic, yeah. I like to think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. The, the water, the colors, the you know, the Bahamians, the whole lifestyle of it. It's definitely a lot, a lot more exotic than the Keys, but we have some good things planned for the next rendezvous that it's only going to keep getting better and better. And oh, we're very excited for well, it. We hope to see you there. Oh, for sure, Derek. Thank you very much for coming on. My pleasure, Zach. 
it's mm. great having you guys and uh, thanks well, for everything no, you guys No, thank you do. very much for, for helping us yesterday. <laughs> we should actually tell them really quick about, did we get any pictures of getting these Sea off the <laughs> Well, it's funny because we got to explain it. Because we, we, we landed yesterday and we'd put all our stuff on the boat to come over and you'd help me put them on the boat. Right. So we get them like, well, where's the boat? The marina? Oh no, we'll go to the beach, it's over there. I was like, well, where's the boat? It's out there. 50 feet offshore. <laughs> Oh, where's the equipment? <laughs> on the boat. The boat. <laughs> well, how big is it? <laughs> well, let me tell you, these float. Yeah. Um, but when you're dragging a sea bob, it, it, it's, <laughs> <laughs> it's not, the, not the most fun part, but we, we made it. We, we made it, made yeah, it happen. Yeah, we made it happen, but uh, God, we should have got more of that on film, shouldn't we? <laughs> <laughs> that would have been funny as hell. Uh, had the drone flying over with the, with the Yeti dragon behind the, the sea bar, right? Well, Lee, had yeah. the, Lee had the Yeti, the guy on the sea bob, Lee had his arm around his neck, right? And, dragging it. and at one point he had a paddleboard, it looked like a train you guys had, an assembly train, but... It worked, that was fun. Way, we made it, so cheers uh, to that, man. Cheers. Again, thanks for everything. No, man. thank you very much, buddy. Good to see you. Yes, sir. Did you say you were... Uh, so did one. Julie Zub take over from you at eight? Julie Zub did, uh, she's now the new marketing director. So she, she got took your position basically? Um, not really, I was the marketing events manager. Right. Um, I worked directly with the vice president of um, Active Interest Media right. for the Marine Group. Mm -hmm. um, she ended up moving up to a uh, division called Catapult, which is a uh, brand and marketing services that for, for not just the marine industry, for um, Yoga Journal, Vegetarian Magazine, uh, the horses, the ski Vegetarian magazine? magazine. Yeah. That must be the most boring magazine on the planet. <laughs> They actually have some good recipes if you're, if you're well, vegetarian yeah. or vegan, you know, they got some good good pointers, but, and those people are pretty cool. They're, 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 so the magazine company is actually 116 magazines, I believe they're, they're still growing, they're buying all these different brands, but it's every kind of niche market that you could think of, and I was in charge of the uh, marine industry, so that's kind of where Interesting. I evolved from. It's funny, because when I first came to this country, we don't have guns in the UK, it's like a taboo yeah. subject. You come here and there's guns and ammo <laughs> on the shelf, it's like, I'm going to read that, I did read it actually. Buy, you used to be able to buy them at Walmart, I don't know if you can still do it. But they used to have a shotgun what? selection I, and bullets. You see, they and say that like on, <laughs> on the new stuff. I've been into Walmarts. I've never seen guns in Walmart. It's America. <laughs> America! <laughs> oh, man, God. Oh, yeah, man. Dear idea. It's cool. It's a good time. Yeah. America's fun. So, Trump, no? Yeah? Uh, no, no comment. <laughs> We're not, no, polit no politics. Yeah, right? let's just hope everything stays peaceful. That's all I ask for. Right? Well, <laughs> okay, well, now, now we. The well, new section of the show is, is what do you know about Yeti? Oh, right, yeah. So, what do you know about Yeti? Well, every. Since I'm in the marine industry, every. Gift that we've given in any goodie bag has been a Yeti, either a tumbler or a cooler. Yeah, I mean, we actually have two of the big bags, the new. new I saw them on like the boat. There, the, the, the big cooler bags. They're, yeah, the cooler with the zip. They're nice. So we're actually giving away as prizes for um, some of our um, just different categories that we have. So we have like the best cruiser, top cruiser. We had some beach Olympics yesterday. So hey, who won the fancy dress? We we, we came to play. Well, we're gonna announce it tonight at the seafood oh. festival. So stay tuned. <laughs> Okay. What his costume was. Oh, I actually I have a couple of videos of you. Uh, we'll cut that in too. The videos of you rocking out last night. Oh. <laughs> I think you actually had a pair of uh, slippers, if I'm not <laughs> too recall. Down the front. Yeah. Oh, I think I left them in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was it's, trying them oh, on. I, I actually wanted to try them on, you know? <laughs> I wouldn't. But uh, no, because the trousers I had on were really tight on the ankles. Okay. So I woke up this morning, there were a pack of cigarettes <laughs> on my ankles <laughs> and the slippers were on the other side. <laughs> <laughs> Keeping it classy, I love it. <laughs> oh, dear. That's awesome. That's awesome. Uh, but yeah, Yetis, I mean, they're not the best coolers in the world, but they kind of are. I mean, I I love them. Mm. I think that they're the best oh, yeah, things. I, my, I actually got my parents a gift, a Yeti tumbler, and that's one yeah. of their favorite gifts. I mean, I've got my mom diamonds and yeah. rubies and pearls. And she got the Yeti cup. She's like, my coffee stays hot all day. Like, yeah. Until it's, the next day. Like, well, it's funny, I make a cup of tea in the morning, I put it in there. It's hotter. I can't drink it till 2 in the afternoon. <laughs> and it's, it's hotter. Great. And it's great because I forget about it. And I'm like, oh my god, the, finding a cup of tea is the best oh. thing, as long as it's still hot. But, yeah. uh, it's awesome. I mean, all my friends, I mean, the fishing tournaments, the the rendezvous, the, just the, the marine side of it, they they live by it. I mean, but why is, why is that? Is it because it, it's a good cooler, it's very expensive for a cooler, 
But it's how do quality. they? It I mean, is quality. It is yeah. quality. I mean, it's, it's you can you can bang them around. I mean, you can mm. float it behind sea sea bobs. You yeah. know, you yeah, can, yeah, yeah. They, they're they're but like almost indestructible. Well, it's, it's funny though because they're <laughs> so expensive. Like you don't want to dink it. <laughs> it's like no. you don't even want to put anything in it. You know? <laughs> Easy with that. We did last. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. We well, it's funny. We had all the camera equipment to go to the party on our back of our golf cart. I right. uh, had a few drinks, so I went around the corner and one of them flew off into the road. <laughs> camera survived though, which is pretty cool. See that? I yeah. Mean, it's, it's, a, it's, a good, it's a good testament for all the equipment. <laughs> <laughs> that speaks for itself. Yeah. You know? Exactly. So what's up? When am I going to get one of these? I need to get one of the wheels, man. I've never seen one of the wheels. Well, that's the, the, wheel, the wheels are more expensive than the cool <laughs> I bet, that's awesome, mm. man. I think you got a great thing going on. I think, you know, Trip to Yetis is pretty... Yeah, and we'll definitely uh, keep you in on when we when we go live. Sure, man, let me know. Whatever I can do to help you guys. And... Oh, have you got a card on you, man? Uh, I have one back in my room, but... I'll grab one for you tonight. I'll give you my cell phone directly, and cool. you shoot me a text whenever we get back. Where do you, where do you base out of? Uh, Fort Lauderdale. Okay. So our office is on 84. Okay. Uh, we've kind of gone for a minimalistic office. It's all open plan. So we're kind of doing a studio kind of set. It looks very cool. Did you design the... She's saying the, the no, stand okay. at Palm Beach oh, for Dennis. Yes, the whole display. So we <laughs> loved your grass. Yeah, it was yeah, hot. Yeah. It was hot, but it was good. Yeah. 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 <laughs> we, we, we bought turf to put it in our office. Based on that, yeah. Based on that. Yeah. Yeah. If you need somebody to install it, I got you. <laughs> Why would you lay on the floor like a mat? It looks yeah, really cool. It's, it's really awesome. <laughs> but we got an off cut of it because it was originally 400 bucks. Yeah. They you screwed get up with every turn. So the big well, yeah, we got it. Well, someone had cut a piece yeah. off, so it was. Uh, not full. Remnant. 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 Love Remnant. Yeah, and depending on the size, it's even more expensive. Yeah, you know. and it's great stuff. We've got it for 40 bucks. Hi, how are you? Like, $40? 40 dollars. It's like uh, eight, eight, it's half off, and then the checkout yeah, system no gave us another half, <laughs> and then accidentally gave us another half. That's <laughs> eight. Yeah. So it's happened for a reason. Right? But it's like 20 foot long and 10 foot wide. It's like, hey, that's great. That's awesome. I actually just did something with the All Stars. We had a 157 foot yacht um, and a couple other yachts that they did. They signed the official uh, headphones of the the Mar. Uh, the, Major League Baseball. Yeah. So I had a, the, the ba baseball commissioner, a um, couple of people from the Yankees, a couple of people from the Mets, the Rockies, um, and they had these headphone things. Um, and we did this whole display with grass on each side and then uh, nice wood floors. Ooh. And it turned out really nice. I'll show you some pictures later. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'd love to see Pretty that. Cool. Huh, yeah. that's very, very So I'm trying cool. to build, actually, I'm trying to build a bridge between the sporting industry and the yachting industry and kind of lay myself together. at their mercy and let them cross over me and, wow. you know, and build that bridge. And well, how many guys you got working for, or is it just you? It ranges anywhere from, I'll have two or three, or I'll have one guy works alongside of me to 50 to 100, I mean. Wow. Depending on, on the operations. I'm, I'm trying to shoot for this next boat show, uh -huh. uh, five different clients, so five different bobs. Five different bobs. Yeah. Yeah. Sounds like five headaches. Huh? Hey man, I'll take it. Yeah. Five different paychecks, you know? Yeah, exactly. Beautiful thing. I'm blessed and yeah. very happy to be doing what I'm doing. With. Very cool. Love making people happy. Absolutely. That's, that's that's the end game, isn't it? That's my energy. That's what I feed off. Yeah. So that's the kind of candor attitude. <laughs> I, want I like to instill it on them, you know? Make sure that they, they lead with a yes. Yeah. There's never a no. We can do it. Very cool.